in the figure here point d is on ac we have point d here what is the degree measure of angle b a c so we have to find out this angle let's call this angle theta so if we could find out this value then we can answer the question because some of these three angles is going to be 180 degrees in triangle abd but let us see that what do we have from these statements the first statement says that measure of angle b d c is equal to 60 degrees let's quickly mention it here b d c is equal to 60 degrees now remember one thing that in any triangle and we are looking at triangle a d b now a b b the exterior angle which is angle here is always equal to the sum of the other two interior angles the reason is that sum of these three angles is 180 and sum of these two angles is also 180 which means the exterior angle is always sum of the other two interior angles and we are going to use this property so we understand from the first statement that theta plus 20 degrees should be equal to 60 degrees which means theta is equal to 40 degrees so this statement alone is sufficient to answer the question. Now we are left with the only option A and B. The second statement here says that the degree measure of angle BAC B -A -C is less than the degree measure of angle BCD. That means this angle is greater than theta. But since we do not have any way to find out the unique value of theta, therefore the second statement alone will not be sufficient to answer the question and final answer to the question becomes option A. I hope you enjoyed the explanation. Thank you so much.